is Axel, I'm a filmmaker based here in LA and today we're gonna be wrapping this lens. The instructions are really simple. I've done a lot of videos uh, with this company. I love them, I love what they do. And people sometimes ask me, hey, is it hard to, to wrap it? Like, did it took a long time? And honestly, it takes me longer than it should take a normal person because I'm not very good with like fine detail. I have big hands but we're gonna try it today and see if I can get it down to like five minutes. So that's my goal. When you get your package and you get it out, in this case, this one is pretty simple because it's for a lens. We did a video about the camera and that one was a little bit trickier, but still I was surprised that I could get it done so quickly. So their instructions are really simple. They come in the package, but I threw them out. Like who reads the instructions, right? That's why you're watching this video. So basically you want to take all the lines, start top to bottom, but put this big one first because that will show you where the scenes end and then you can line everything up. It makes it so much easier. So we're gonna start with that one. I think I'm going to find this piece that has the Canon logo on it. I'm going to line that up. And the beauty of this skin is if you get it wrong, it doesn't matter. Like you can peel it off and then put it back on. I'm going to do this really slow, nice and steady. I see there I made a mistake, so I just peel back a little bit and go back on it. So just remember, try not to stretch the skin. Like it will take the shape of the lens by itself. So slowly there. So we're doing this other side. And you see, and you get to the end. So at the end, it should be flush. So I'm gonna stretch it, I'm gonna lift it and stretch a little bit. And as you can see, bam! So I'm gonna inspect every area, push a little bit. There's one little piece here that I have a little bubble. I'm gonna press that out. Now it's taking shape. So next we're gonna go start at the top. We're gonna peel this one, put the lens down. And this goes right above the red ring. So I'm going to find that place where my other piece connected and I'm just going to start there, you know, to make it easier. I'm going to line up this right here and then I just go all the way around the red line. I got a little piece wrong there, I'm gonna push back. I'm always afraid I'm gonna get it wrong, but then it just kind of like magically lands. This is awesome. This is looking beautiful. So here, make sure you leave enough gap between the, the skin on the top section and the focus ring. That way you don't have any problems later. If you're covering the ring, the red ring, you're going too high. So make sure you don't cover the red ring. It should be perfectly aligned. You also have this little tools that come in the package. So pretty handy. Now I'm gonna test the focus ring. See, it was a little stiff at first, but then perfect. Next we have this very thin little line. We're almost done, see? We're going to find where they connect. Start there. Then we have this little piece. It goes here on the lock. Now we have this last two pieces. Now we just need the last piece it's for the lens hood. The thing is, with the lens hood, you're going to definitely complete the look. So, lens hood is pretty simple. Take it out. I love this. We're going to find the Canon brand. And we're gonna line up the little red dot. There's a beautiful red dot right here. You line that up first. And then you line up the logo cut out. And make sure the edge is connecting well. Once you do that, everything else will just fall into place. I'm 
almost there, baby. Ta-da! That's it. Midnight Red. Make sure you can zoom in and zoom out. And that's how you install a Midnight Red lifeguard skin on your lens. 24 to 70 millimeter. Funny thing, this lens has been with me since 2014. I bought it, it was the first lens that I bought with this camera kit. This lens has been everywhere. I took it to Nigeria, I've taken it to Cuba, to Hawaii, filmed all over the US. It's one of my favorite lenses because I've shot so many good projects with it. And now it looks freaking amazing. So if you had any questions about the skin, hit me up on Instagram. I'm always over there showing behind the scenes. And I hope you like the video. Please subscribe, hit that like button, send this video to a friend that might be installing the skin. And there's a little link in the description if you want to get some nice discounts on the skins. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked the video. My name is Axel and I'll see you in another one.